Hi there, I'm Eric Slack, and I'm here to tell you how to build and sell apps, not content. Thanks for joining me today at ng-conf. I want to persuade you to start using headless CMS in your software development with Angular. Let me start by defining the term headless CMS. CMS stands for Content Management System. You might have heard of some of these before, such as WordPress, Joomla, Drupal, there are many. A headless CMS is one that decouples the application to write the content from the application used to display the content. So instead of having everything all in one, such as a classic CMS would do for you, you can separate that into two completely separate applications. One of them you don't even have to build. That is the headless CMS. And you can use that content how you want to in your CMS. Let me make a brief analogy of why this is great. The people writing the news don't have any effect on the platform that displays their news or at least they can't control it completely. In fact, multiple platforms could display the same news in different ways in infinite locations. Why should content for your applications be any different? The correct answer is it shouldn't. The main reason to use a CMS in the first place is that you want to allow a client or a coworker or a friend who doesn't know how to code a website, but who does know how to write a Word document on their computer, to be able to manage the content on their website. A headless CMS enables you to do that. So many people would choose a classic CMS because that's what they're familiar with. Instead, if you use a headless CMS, you can still give your client, your friend who doesn't know how to code, the ability to write the content without knowing any coding skills. And you, the Angular developer, can control how that gets displayed. One second, it's my client, Patricia. Hey, Patricia. Hi, Eric. Thanks for the work you did last weekend on my app. I read your message about using a CMS, but I have no idea what that is. Um, so can you tell me more about it? Using a CMS means you will be able to edit parts of your application on your own. You don't need to learn any developer skills, so don't worry about HTML. You will be able to edit things similar to how you write in a Word document. Here's why it's gonna be awesome if you decide to go with the headless CMS that I'm suggesting. One, you will be able to react instantaneously to the need to change your website. You won't have to wait for me to do something in nine out of 10 cases. That means you can react faster. Number two, you can easily add all kinds of content to the website, such as images, yes, videos, and downloadable content. Number three, you can avoid spending developer hours and money on building your own interface for managing content. That means money saved and time to launch your app significantly reduced. For me, this is going to save me a ton of time and effort. No more calls from the client in the middle of the night asking for urgent changes. No more needing to remind the customers that they are responsible for writing content. I'm going to save a ton of time doing the work I like the least so I can spend more time doing the work that I love, the Angular stuff. All right, thank you. Awesome, thanks Patricia, bye. The best ideas benefit everyone. Bring up using a headless CMS to your clients. It could save them and you a ton of pain. Hold on, my phone's ringing again. This time it's my boss. Hey, Michael. I want you to call me on Zoom. I have some questions. Okay, yeah. I will move into my office and we can do a Zoom call. Just a minute. I have some questions for you about the headless CMS thing you proposed. Can you explain why this is going to help our business? Second, which provider do you suggest that we go with? Great questions, boss. I know you already get the basics of headless CMS, so let me explain the specifics of, for enterprises like us. On top of everything else we already discussed, this is the gist. We can put the marketing content directly in the hands of the marketing team. They can put content into our web applications in public pages and also behind the paywall without any help from engineering at all. Long story short, we get one, less distractions for engineering. Two, faster turnaround and less obstacles for marketing. And three, the ability to add and update content without needing to deploy any code. Oh, so like WordPress? 
Well, kind of, except we can keep building our application in Angular. Oh, uh, now I get it. It sounds like a great idea. Let's do it. I'll talk to product and get it added to the roadmap. Great. It sounds like my boss is happy. Use a headless CMS with your Angular applications so you spend more time building apps and selling them and less time making content. Next steps, go check out my ngconf article, Build and Sell Apps, Not Content. Follow me on Twitter. I'm Eric underscore Slack. In closing, I just want to say thank you. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. You didn't even give your talk yet. You just talked on the phone the whole time and then you introduced yourself. It's good. Ship it.